I think my message for people that don't see the power in their voice or don't see the potential in creating any kind of change as an individual, um, I would say looking through history, most or a lot of change that has mattered has happened independently of what our leaders believe or what our independently of or what our leaders have done or accomplished. Um, if you look through different movements and different time periods where you know, people created some of the greatest changes that have shaped the world to be what it is today. And now more than ever, when we see time and time again that our leaders have failed us, failed to represent our voices, you know, failed to speak for the people, failed to protect our planet, our land, um, failed to look at the long-term impact of their, of their decisions and, and working only for, for short-term profit, um, I think we have to stop putting so much faith in our leaders. And, you know, I come from the United States where a lot of our leaders are, are owned by industry. Um, and a lot of the decisions made by our leaders are dictated by the industries that um, tend to benefit from that rather than from the people. And what that has just shown me is that, you know, when we allow those in power to make decisions for us, we're often going to be unhappy with the outcomes. Whereas if we really begin to use our, our, our voice in a way that changes maybe a, a small thing at the beginning, a local issue working in our communities at, at first, like that ripples out and has a huge impact. Um, but truly, you know, your voice matters. And, and if, if it's just one, it's hard to see that. But um, I feel like one of the most impactful ways to see that your voice makes a difference is when you can collaborate and work with other people in your communities to, to, to have those important conversations and feel supported. Like it's really hard to do this alone. You know, it's really hard to be um, to feel like you're the only person involved and so I guarantee you that you know there are other people out there that you just got to reach out and you got to put your voice out there and your passions out there and other people will come to support you and the things that you believe in but truly the change that is gonna is gonna come in this world I believe is gonna come from people not from our leaders um, I believe that the legacy that we will leave behind will not be dictated by those in power um, that the legacy that we leave behind will be shaped by the artists, the entrepreneurs, the teachers, the students, the activists, the, the front lines fighters, the, you know, the people that have always been at the forefront of change in this world. Those will be the ones that are shaping the legacy that will be passed on, shaping the legacy of a generation um, in the way that generations in the future will remember us by.